My baby was only 16, birthday coming up, hotel party. We had already plans. She's a cancer survivor, didn't die of cancer. She got hit by a car. But Big Bobby was a world to me. Bobby Grayson beat leukemia at seven. Her silliness and smile are memories her family says they'll hold on to. The smile, when you'd see her, that smile on her face, I gotta know her. Kathy Cagle will never see her baby girl smile again. Police say 28-year-old Anthony Loria was drinking and driving when he hit Bobby Tuesday afternoon as she was walking near school and then left her in the road to die. He couldn't be a man to own up to what he did and let my child die by herself. Police say Loria hit a curb, his tire tracks leading police to his home. He was caught and cuffed, later admitting to officers he had been drinking and that he had too much. Police say after the crash, Loria came home and drank vodka out of a sippy cup. This is where kids like Bobby walk to school. There's a sidewalk, but in two spots, it leads to a cinder block wall forcing pedestrians into the street. It just doesn't look right. We went straight to the city of North Las Vegas. Greg Blackburn confirms the city is looking into it. We'll verify our records and then take whatever action we can we're able to legally. After the crash, when officers asked Loria why he drove home, he said he would have stopped if he killed someone. Where's baby Bobby? You know, it's not right. 16 years old, it's not right. It's not right.